if I don't do it, they will kill you. But I say you will not die. I am seeing a lady. You have a ring. You have a ring with you. There is a ring that gave you. This ring is gold and black on top. Zata, it's you. It's you. Come here. This is an urgent matter. We cannot afford to lose a soul because of evil works. Beloved, I was terrified at the thought of how bad this could have turned out. But God is a good God. Family, this prophecy shows the importance of having a spiritual cover in your life. What is your name? Patricia. Patricia. The ring I'm talking about. Beloved, look closely at this ring. It's precisely just as Pastor Off had described it. Gold with a black stone family. This is incredible. Patricia. Yes, Mama. Hear me. God say your matter is urgent. And God say that I shall intervene and pray for you now. Yes, man of God. Because... Not only of this ring, but because of what is happening in your life. Yes. I am seeing you, Patricia. The one who gave you the ring is not your first husband. Yes, man of God. Because your first husband's name was Ndabazile. Yes, man of God. Is that true? Yes. My God. This man stayed with you. You have your child together. Yes, man of God. Because I'm seeing a little one, a little girl called Tandeka. Yes, it's my child. Tandeka is your child. Yes. Was Tandeka born on the 12th of September 2011? Yes. Wow. I am in awe. One wonders how the man of God sees all this. God is truly in this place. Tandeka was born on the 12th of September 2011. 11. Yes, men of God. But you were born on the 30th of June. Yes, men of God. Your husband, the father of Tandeka, was born on the 21st of January. Is that correct? Yes, men of God. This man and you are no longer together because even when you were together with him, you had somebody else on the other side. Yes, men of God. I don't want to embarrass you. I want to get this devil out of you. Amen. Yes, it's Deal with it, Papa. While you were with your husband, there was another man next. So you had a, a spare tire. Uh -huh. That's very interesting. At least she's bold enough to admit it. This is not to embarrass her. God is going to the very root of her pain. That thing that's claiming her life will be destroyed. Mm. Is that correct? Yes. Koboshia. You see, the reason why I'm saying this, my dear one, is because I see you and your husband over rental money you fought. Your landlord wanted money earlier than usual. Yes, it's true. Is that true? Yes. Koboshia. But when you fought, he beat you up. And I see you running, you call the police. And as the police came, he realized that he will get arrested. He jumped from the fifth floor down. Yes, it's true. And he hurt himself. Yes. His family came and took him. They said, you're a wrong wife for your husband. They took the child away. But you didn't care because you had your spare tire. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's true. Is that true? Yes. You know David? Yes, I know. Who's David? David is my boyfriend. As this one left, you decided immediately to also take Tandeka. You moved to David's house. You stayed together. Yes, it's true. Is that true? Yes. I'm not shaming you because we need to, we need to kick some devils out. Man. Now, hear this. This is where I'm going to. On the 22nd of October last year, 22nd of October 2017, David proposed to you while being together. 
and gave you this ring. Is that true? Yes, it's true. But what you do not know is that when David gave it to you, he was not just proposing you. Though he loved you, this ring is not a normal ring. Sure. What does the man of God mean that this is not a normal ring? God have mercy. This is not a normal ring. That's why on the 22nd you got the ring. The 23rd, the 24th of October, the 25th of October in the morning, David started bleeding. Before night, David fell and died. Three days after proposing. Yes, it's true. Is that true? Yes. You see, your David wanted to sacrifice you. Mm. Do you know about what I'm talking about? Yes, baby. Sorry, look at me. Do you know about what I'm talking about? Yes. I'm not making it up. Is it true? Yes, it's true. How do you know that? No. How do you know what I'm telling you? Do you know that your David was into uh, uh, Satanism? Did you know that? He, he told me after I put this ring, he confessed to me. He said he wants me to join Satanism. That's why I put this ring. Wait, I'm a little baffled. She knows that the ring is demonic, but she still puts it on. Worse yet, she kept it even after David's death. Is this woman okay? This makes absolutely no sense. So he told you that he wanted you. So the engagement was not just a natural engagement. It was also a spiritual engagement. He gave you the ring and said that uh, as I put the ring, I want you to, to join Satanism. Yes. <laughs> My God. Look, David died on the 25th of October. Is that correct? Yes. Is that correct? Yes, it's true. But I am seeing people following you. I am seeing people following you because David's supposed to make a sacrifice over you and it did not work. That's why he died. Now, yes. it's like the, uh, the screaming blood and this ring in your finger. Somebody tells you that the ring is a satani is satanism. It does. You still have it. That's precisely what I said. Where is the logic behind all of this? She had better make the right decision today. May God help her. Family, sometimes we keep ourselves bound. Why is that ring still on her finger? I I'm glad. I'm glad you are in church today. For how long have you been coming here? Do you come to church here? No. It's my first time. It's your first time Ooh. today. Thank you, Lord, that this is the day of her deliverance. What brought you here? What brought you? How did you know us all? What brought you here? I saw you in the TV. So what to TV? You saw us on TV? Yes. That's why you came? Yes. Are you in trouble? Are you in trouble? Yes. You are in trouble? Yeah. Tell me about it. They, they give me one week to sacrifice my child. This is serious trouble. This is a matter of life and death. The devil is so cruel. How do you expect a mother to sacrifice her own child? May God punish the devil. She is clearly terrified. She needs immediate intervention from above. Look at me. They gave you one week to sacrifice your child. Yes. Meaning what? They, they, what they do you mean? They say they need blood. So if I, if you not kill child, they will kill me. There is no way out of this. God is the only solution. So they told you. They told you. Who told you? Who are those guys? There is a two guy. He came in my house. They don't want to sit down. They tell me. Must bring the blood. Two guys came to your house. Look at me. I'm here to help you. Two guys came to your house. Kabosa. Was one an Indian guy? Hey. Yes. Another one was a black guy. Yes. Is that true? Yes. And they said to you, how many days? One week. One week. Yes. Meaning seven days. 
Yes. They're saying seven days you must sacrifice your child. Yes. And that child is Tandeka. Yes. And they say if you don't sacrifice the child, what happens? They kill me. They'll kill you. Yes. All right. They will not kill her. She has come to AMI. Witness the calm that Pastor Of has. He knows his God cannot be defeated. Family, the devil is under our feet. When did they come to your house? On Wednesday. They came to your house this Wednesday. Yes. So your seven days or one week counts Wednesday till next Wednesday. Yes. That's what they told you. Yes. So what did you do when you hear that? You heard that? What did you do? Why is she quiet? Please don't tell me she sacrificed her child. That would be horrific. Why is she not answering? Look at me. Speak to me. What did you do? Oh, I fear she might have considered performing this evil deed. All right. Look. It will not end up like that. It will not Thank like God that. my assumptions were incorrect. I speak freedom over all of you. I receive freedom. I say I speak freedom over all of you. I receive it. Whoever pulls you down, the Lord will pull him down. In the name of Jesus. Now your child is innocent. Your child is not wearing a ring. But they want the blood of your child. Yes. And people come to your house. They just tell you there and you allow them to go. So what did you do? You started crying. That's all. That's what you did. No, I need help. You need help? I, yeah. I no? don't know what to do because I love my child. I don't want to live this life. Look at me. Show me your ring. Should I keep it here or should I remove it? Remove, remove it. it. Remove it. She has removed it. This is the very first step toward her deliverance. She's facing one hard matter, but it is well. After Pastor Alf prays over her, those evil devil worshipping hooligans will never return. <laughs> See, the devil is a liar. The liar. Now, the, do you know the implication of things like this? Hmm. Just because of a ring. Or because David, you put yourself in a boyfriend. David didn't come to you. knew that you were a married woman. Didn't come to you because of love only. Hmm. He realized that uh, it was fine together. But uh, it came to you because of many things, because that's what they do. You become just a sacrifice for a day, but with you it didn't work. Yeah. But it left you with a ring and you're carrying the ring. The devil is a liar. liar. Yeah. When I look at you, I'm already seeing a lot of problems because you have a sister called Alice. Yes. Is that true? Yes, it's Your true. sister Alice has a problem with her womb. She's battling womb cancer since 2014. Is that correct? Yes, it's correct. It's correct? Yes. Since 2014, she's battling womb cancer. Yes, it's true. And you are only the two of you. Alice does not have a husband, does not have a child. You have Tandeka. You now, only two people. Mm. You give your child away. Do you want to kill your child? Do you want to give your child? You want to sacrifice your child? No. Do you know Jesus can set you free? Yes, he can. Yes. He can set her free and restore her completely. He is our strength. Everybody, stretch your hands to her. This one was a son of the covenant they had. And this is what the Lord showed me. You see, there is an ancient matter. And I should come. And I break this today. 
I speak freedom. In the name of Jesus. I speak deliverance. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I am seeing two men. Those are the two men that came to you. One is an Indian man. Yes. He's about 38 years old. Yes, it's true. With dark hair. Yes. And the other one is a short Zulu boy. Yes. Nothing is hidden before our God. They will be dealt with accordingly. Their identities were revealed prophetically. It doesn't get better than this. Let me tell you. You did good to come to the house of God. Glory to Jesus. Today, I break the yoke of the enemy. She's Free. freed from Satanism. Thank you, Jesus. In that the name which of Jesus. the enemy had orchestrated Free. will not unfold. Her. As break the spirit. spirit leaves her, every covenant made with Satan is destroyed. Neither her nor her child will die. The blood of Jesus is against the influence of Satan in Jesus' name. Whoever wanted you dead, I give them 24 hours of repentance. Beloved, 24 hours of repentance and not a second longer. I said 24 hours. I said 24 hours. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. If you were blessed by this video, be sure to subscribe to our channel. You can catch Pastor Arthur Kao on AMI TV on the public bouquet or on our live stream on AMITV.com. You can follow Pastor Arthur Kao on all social media platforms at Arthur Kao.